What's going on guys? Adam Snyder here with the Homemade Entrepreneur. Today I want to show you how to make money using Craigslist and eBay. We're going to be using both of those, alright? So what I'm going to show you is how to find decent products to buy on Craigslist and resell those on eBay. Now you can do it the other way around where you buy them on eBay and sell them on Craigslist, but that will be for a different video. So right here we're on Craigslist.com. You can kind of see it up here. So what we're going to do what I like to do is I like to go in photo and video and toys and games. We're going to go in toys and games and I'm going to look for board games, right? You can spell it both ways. I'm just spelled with space. Okay. Board games, just like that. Um, so right here, let's see. Let's look at, let's try to find some different stuff. Mighty Monsters board game. Mighty Monsters. Come over here to eBay, right there. Paste it in. And we'll also click on sold listing. Uh, board game by Halaklaka. Hol I don't know. I don't know what that means. Anyway. Mighty Monsters board game. Um, I'm not sure what it looked like. Like that. Uh, so we just come down here, try to find it. Okay. For the sake of this video, I'm not going to go through everything. But you get the point. So then we're going to go. Let's actually just do board game. See if there's, there we go. A little bit different stuff. So one of the things I'm, I want to show you is that some of these games like Monopoly right here. Okay, this Deluxe Edition Monopoly. One of the things I would do is ask to see the date. Okay, there's probably a date on here somewhere, and ask to see that. All right. So uh, we're gonna do Deluxe Edition Monopoly over on eBay. All right. So Deluxe Edition Monopoly. Okay, it is, looks like that. Okay, it's brand new. It's about $28 is what it's selling for. Here's one right here, brand new. Um, now we can go into used. Um, I'll just click on used for now. So let's try to find it. Here it is right here. Pre-owned, $21. Sold on July 28th. That was a few days ago. Another one, uh, this is the 1998 edition. So just make sure this is the 1998 edition. Okay, pre-owned. Uh, this one pre-owned, 28 bucks. This one selling for 32. It's a 98 edition. The inside looks very similar to the pictures that we just saw right here. Okay, so that's all you have to do. Now, I like board games. Honestly, I, I actually love to go and find board games because people don't know what they have. But the funny thing is, it's not just board games that people have that they're selling and they don't know the, the true value of, especially older games. Okay, so you can go and you can swoop in, you can say give them $5, negotiate down, try to give them two or three, even though you're going to make some money off it, you got to understand this is a business, you got to look at everything as a business, okay, if you can make an additional two or three dollars per transaction that you do, why not do it, if you do 50 uh, transactions a month and you can make an additional 100 to 150 dollars on those 50 transactions, why not do it, right, it's very simple, now, I do have a guide that I'll put down below. It is a paid guide. It's $10. It's, a, it's called 40 Profitable Items Every Reseller Should Know. I talk about more than just board games. Okay, Show you different items that you should really look into when you go into thrift stores, yard sales, pawn shops, and places like that. So let's do a few more. All right? Let's do a few more board games. Like I said, I like board games. Uh, here's Drop Mix Collection. Now, uh, some are priced at $100 something like this they're probably uh it's probably something that they've taken care of so just be aware of that um let's do let's do this one right here all right it's uh authentic indonesian hand carving board game or chess set and carved there hand carved chess board Okay, so there we go. You can kind of see it right here, kind of what it looks like. Um, let's see if they have one. Brand new. This one's going to be pre-owned. Pre-owned. So that one might not be worth it. Let's go look at something else, right? So actually, let's go look at a different place. Let's go to, um, let's go somewhere else. Let's go to Boise, Idaho, right? Let's go there. Let's do the same thing. Toys and games, okay? You can I'm going to type in board game. Some people put board game together, so just be aware of that. Um, let's see if it changes any. This is 1 of 35, board game, no results. Cool. So, right there, board game. 
Wangle board game. Okay, they're uh, Wangle games. New it's like spoons game, asking ten each or three for twenty. Fair the regular price, twenty five percent shipping. Um, so Wangle board game. Let's type that in. Sorry, Wangle game. Mm, let's see. Should be here somewhere. But well, we're not going to look for it. Anyway, let's go look for something else. I'll just do another one and then that'll be about it. One thing I've found, there are some of these operation games. Um, they're actually in Spanish. So look out for some of those because they do really well. Light bright, flat screen. Okay. Board game blowout. PC, the other ones. All games, five dollars each for five for 20. Um, pressing condition. Light bright, flat screen. Let's type that in. Light bright stuff usually does pretty good. Um, bright, flat screen. Here we go. So let's see if we can find something very similar. It's like that one right there. Um, similar to this one. Okay. You can probably get more for it. Now, if you have more of the pieces, I don't know how many this one, well, we're not going to look, but I don't know how many this one actually has. Um, 2003 tested. So all you got to do, if they're selling $5 or five games for $20, um, that means you can get it for $4. Okay. Yeah, it looks like that, that's the right one. Okay, it looks like it's that one right there. So selling for $9.99, $15 shipping. Shipping on this probably, uh, I don't know where you're at in the country, but you got to assume it's going to go the furthest it can. Okay, so let's say something in this box. It's probably a lighter item. You're probably looking at, I don't know, my guess. Again, I don't ship a lot of stuff, so don't quote me on this, but it'll probably be anywhere from like, you know, 8 to $12. So eight to twelve dollars, you buy it for four. Uh, you're in at sixteen. Let's say you sell it for twenty-five. You're in for sixteen, um, sell it for twenty-five, and eBay fees. You, know, you can make some money off it, but the majority of it's gonna go right to shipping. So just be aware of that. But there's a lot of things, not just board games either. All right, let's go look at something else. Where is um, home? Household right there. Okay. So here's another thing you do. Come to household and a lot. So this rainbow stuff, okay, rainbow does pretty well. Kirby does really well for vacuum parts, um, Dyson stuff, because people will, and I just want you, go and look, okay? It happens all the time. People will buy this, these, you know, really good quality vacuums and it will hold the vacuum systems and sets. But the problem is when the vacuum goes out, they give away the parts. They pretty much just give these away. All right, so go and look. Some people will sell them because they know what they have. They're trying to recoup some of their costs. But all you gotta do is go find those people and buy it. Okay, uh, Ben Domino. Let's look at that one. I sold one of these before. It's been a while though. Ben and Domino. There we go. All right here, so brand new, fifteen dollars free shipping. This person is wanting five dollars for it. Cool. I try to get it down to like three dollars. And then sell it because something the size of this, it's probably going to sell, or it's probably going to cost you, I don't know, maybe probably like six to six to nine dollars to ship it. But you got to look here, fifteen dollars. This one's pre-owned, okay? This one's pre-owned, eight forty-five plus twenty-four dollars shipping, okay? This one's eleven sixty. This one sold for about nineteen twenty bucks, okay? So you got to be aware of that. Just because this one's the lowest doesn't mean that's always the price. This one. Okay, shipping killed them. Uh, it's coming from Canada. Um, this one down here, about twenty dollars. Okay, so on July sixteenth, so about two weeks ago. So you just gotta be aware of that. There's a lot of stuff out that you can buy, but you have to understand that anything anything can be profitable, but you have to buy it at the right price. So once you understand that, that okay, there's a lot of stuff out there. I need to buy it at the right price. I can't get into this for ten dollars because there'd be no money in it. You gotta understand that. You gotta let that person know. I'm not buying this to keep it. I'm buying it to sell. I can't pay you more than three dollars because once they understand that, you can't pay. It's not that you you don't want to. It's that you can't pay, or else there'd be no point to even buy that item. Now I know you know, and I've done this in the past where I come into a deal. And it's like 
now you know, I'm buying it for my son or I'm buying it for my cousin or my mom or you know my wife or something okay I'm buying it for them and you know I don't really want to spend that much because then they have you kind of on you know a little uh, bit of leverage on you that like well you don't love your wife enough to pay an extra four dollars for this item well I do but honestly that's not for me okay I'm gonna sell it and once you're really open and honest with people and even from the beginning let them know you know I, I am a reseller I, I buy stuff for buy and sell stuff for a living that uh, this is one of those items that I am always on the lookout for. However, I can't pay you five dollars for it. I can pay you three. Um, so, you know, if you want to do a deal for that, I'm I'm out and about the next you know day or so, or I'm going to be in the area. I'll swing by. We'll make the deal happen, and and uh, you won't have to worry about that item anymore. Because I guarantee you, who wants to spend a lot of time looking at or selling an item that's five dollars? Okay. People are going to waste your time. They're coming look at it. No, I don't really want it. It's not what I wanted or uh, it's not exactly what was in the picture or, uh, you know, I was thinking it was going to be bigger or whatever. There's always some type of explanation, some reasoning why somebody doesn't want to buy something. So just be aware of that and just understand if you have money, that means you have the power. All right. So that's all I really wanted to show you today, that there is ways for anybody, no matter where you're from, how much money you have in your pocket, no matter how experienced you are with sales or internet marketing or consulting or whatever, social media, it doesn't matter. There are ways for you to make money. And I just showed you two two places. eBay okay, is one and Craigslist is another one. You can sell from Craigslist to eBay or eBay to Craigslist. You can do either one. They both work and they're both highly effective. So hopefully this video helped you out. Hopefully this video gave you a little bit of insight and ideas as to what you could potentially sell next. If it did, hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you guys on the next one.